In a thunderous roar that echoed across Atlantic City and out over the beaches, all 39 stories and more than three decades of history of the Trump Plaza came crumbling down in an implosion on Wednesday. The former hotel and casino, the first one to bear the former president's name in the Jersey Shore Resort gambling mecca, has sat vacant since it was closed in 2014, 30 years after it opened. About 200 cars full of onlookers gathered at Batterfield on the other side of the city to watch the implosion, while others who paid to have the best seats in the house gathered at the Oneatlantic Atlantic Pier to watch it come down. Others, bundled up, watched from the beach outside the exclusion. The implosion marks the end of an era. Trump Plaza was the 10th casino to open in Atlantic City when it welcomed gamblers in May 1984, seven years after the legalization of gambling in 1977. But after a string of bankruptcies, Trump eventually lost majority ownership of the property. For years after it closed, putting thousands out of work, the building was vacant, passing ownership from Trump Entertainment Resorts to Icon Enterprises in 2016.